Hey guys, this is Joe Tech from Joe Tech Tips. We're on Facebook, Twitter, and Instagram. And today, <laughs> I have a product that everyone should have. I'll have a link in the description below to purchase this. This is a EMF tester, detector. Let you know how much radiation or RF radiation is in your vicinity, such as these lights that are in front of me. Um, obviously, the closer you are to something, the more radiation it gives off. You know, that's, that's dangerous because you're really, you're on top of it. And then as you dis, as you, uh, I guess, move away from it, the, it drops off significantly. Um, these LED lights are dangerous. Anything over 40... So let me go over the, the features of this uh, quickly so you understand it. So milligauss is a rating. Uh, and then there's micro tesla, which is also a, um, a measurement, excuse me. These are measurements. So milligauss milligauss is a rating and a micro tesla is a rating. This meter um, detects both. They're, they're one of the same. One micro Tesla is equal to 10 milligauss. All right. Now, these that's just a measurement. But what the hell does that mean? What's safe? What's not safe? I'm going to go over that real quickly. This also re, uh, reads volts per meter. How much energy volts that are being emitted from the device, similar to like a wireless charger, same thing, except how much voltage is radiating off of that device, which is radiation, or EMF, electromagnetic frequency. This product is called Electromagnetic Radiation Tester. All right? Uh, this is beeping like crazy because there's a lot of radiation. If I put it right here... It'll go down to a safe level, and we won't have to worry about it beeping. I can shut off the, the beep itself, but we're going to go go over. Uh, so anything less than one volt per meter is no concern. Anything between one to five volts per meter is slight concern. Anything from five to 50, volt, uh, 50 volts per meter is severe concern. And anything above 50 volts per meter is extreme concern. Now, um, <laughs> so now we've got to go over the, the uh, micro gauze, uh, 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 I'm sorry, milli gauze and micro tesla and what those readings are. So one micro tesla, like I said, is equal to 10 milli gauze. So one to 10 milli gauze is normal. Anything above 10 milli gauze is a problem. So I created some videos, uh, I walked around my house, and I'm going to show you those videos, and you're going to be kind of blown away, and you're going to buy one of these, like, today, because uh, it's unbelievable. But before we go any further, if you like this video, give me a thumbs up. Uh, if you're not a subscriber, subscribe, if you're liking it so far, and let's get to those videos right now. So believe it or not. It does have zero volts per meter. But as soon as you get close to something, see, my PC is fine. Right? And I start going to LED lighting, close to LED lighting like this. And then it starts to go up. That's crazy. So, obviously, the further you are away from something, the better off you are. So, we're just going to walk around... The house. God, what is causing this? And if you look right here, it's a huge LED. Now watch this. Hey Google, turn off the basement. Unbelievable. There's obviously something here that's causing this. Now my computer system is right here. My rack and everything. So we're like crazy high here. So we could find some. It's like now I'm safe here. 
I'm safe here, but I just moved a couple of feet. Look at that. Boom. So there's obviously something here that's causing that. It's <laughs> whoop, it powered off. And that's a video game that's right here. And it's like off the wall. It's just scary. I mean, like I'm walking through the whole house and this is what I'm doing. And Okay, now I'm safe here at the steps. Now here's the LED lighting that we're on. See, look at that. As soon as I get up to the LED lighting for the box lights from my studio. That's crazy. That scares the crap out of me. Now I go behind. So now I'm further away. So obviously, so this is my studio. All right, so here's my studio. I mean, makeshift studio. And as you go further and further away from the device, the less interference there is or less radiation exposure there is. So since I'm sitting there, I'm safe. But you get close to this, and it, does, it goes off the wall. So let's prove this. Hey, Google, turn off the studio. Perfect. Look at that. Well, I have the camera still on. And that's the camera. So if I'm off over here, it'll hit safe. I'm like three feet away from it. Hey, Google, turn on the studio. All right, turning on studio. See? Look at that. These LED lights, they may use less energy, but they give off harmful, <laughs> harmful Radiation, EMF. That's nutty. That's absolutely nutty. So as I continue through the my house, see now I'm okay. Whoop. So now I'm okay. Everything is fine. But as soon as I get close to something, it gets crazy. So let's check out the washing machine. So the washing machine is right here. So if I'm safe, look at the washing machine. It's the washing machine. Boom. Hey Google, look how high that is. That's crazy. You can't be... <laughs> hey, Google, turn off the washing machine. Now, I have it on a smart plug, okay? It's just it's just plugged into the wall, okay? And I have it on a smart plug because it uses 10 watts doing nothing. And the smart plug is right there, okay? Hey, Google, turn on the washing machine. Sure, turning the washing machine on. How scary is that? What the hell? That's like... <laughs> what, the, what is going on? Hey, Google, turn off the washing machine. Sure, turning the washing machine off. Everybody needs one of these. Okay, my dryer is here. I don't have it on a smart plug because this is 220. So this is using power too, doing nothing. But look, I mean, you're. if I step back a couple of feet, let's see. See, it disappears. It's just the surrounding energy. How about my printer? My printer too. And this printer. So if you're close, if you have a printer that's close to you on your, on your table at your office... Move it away. Move it by three or four feet away and you'll be safe. It's actually emitting harmful EMF. This is crazy. Thank God my PC is okay. Just scary stuff, man. Really scary. Okay, now we're in my kitchen. Everybody has a microwave, right? A, my microwave is right there. Look at that. I just got close to it. Now I have a smart switch on this too. Hey, Google, turn off the microwave. It's obviously something else. What else could it be? Now the Milligors, oh, there we go, that's weird.
So it's still doing something. It must be the oven. Because the oven is on. Okay, that's probably what it is. All right, so... You're going to fall over when I turn the microwave on. <laughs> hey, Google, turn on the microwave. Okay, now I'm going to set it for one minute to run. Watch this explode. Now, this is supposed to be shielded. <laughs> what the hell? So this is giving off. I'm standing right in front of the microwave. 48 volts per meter and 10 uh, milligauss or, or 11 milligauss. But as you walk away further away from the, from the microwave, it disappears, it dissipates. So now it disappeared slightly. It's dropping, you know, it's just dissipating on its own. Now I'm directly in the center of my kitchen and it's, you know, basic stuff. I mean, I have my Google Home here. Look at this, my Google Home. My Google 10 inch display. Sorry, I don't understand. Yeah. That nuts? My, now this is my Amazon. And my smartphone. You can walk away from it, and you're back into safe, safe levels. It's all about distance. Here's my refrigerator. It's crazy. Now, if I turn on LED lighting in the house, let's see in my living room. Hey Google, turn on the living room light at 100%. Okay, let's go up by the light. That's crazy. And the further away you are, so these lights are safe. Because they're far away enough that I'm not going to get radiated by the my LED lighting. It's just crazy, people. It's just absolutely crazy. I'm just trying to keep you in the know. You're gonna ha you need to get one of these. I'll have a link in the description below to purchase it. This it's gonna make you more aware on what you do and how you do it and what devices are close to you and whatnot. And believe it or not, the cell phone doesn't really do anything. Surprisingly, they're pretty clean. So as you can clearly see, the videos that you saw or the video that I showed you is um, disturbing to say the least. The microwave blew me away. When I did the microwave, I was like, what the hell? It's supposed to be clean. It's not supposed to be leaking anything, but it still is. So do not stare in front of the microwave, ever. Walk away, wait for it to be done, then go back to it. Being on right on top of things is not healthy. Printers, right on top of you. LED lighting, right on top of you. This. Is close. It's not. I'm not right on top of it. If I was right in front of it, it would be a problem. This being this far away is safe, as I found out. So I mean, but if I have it here where I'm sitting, it drops down. So I'm kind of in a safe area. As soon as I bring it closer to the camera, it goes off. As soon as I bring it close to me where I'm sitting, it stops. So that range, this range right I'm doing right now, I am in, in a safe area. Um, it's mind-boggling to me, to be honest with you. I'm, I'm totally shocked <laughs> beyond belief. I have these lights here specifically to shine on me so you guys can see me clearly, not knowing that I'm actually doing damage to myself because of these stupid lights. Anyway, guys, I beat this to death enough. Um, it's shocking. I'll have a link in the description below to purchase this. This thing is an amazing product. Um, I can't say more about it. Um, I'm going to be bringing it to every place that I go to verify if I'm in a safe environment. Even at work. So guys, if you like this video, give me a thumbs up. Wow. 
And if you're not a subscriber, please subscribe. Take care, and we'll see you next time.